There's nothing like it. The excitement of Texas Tech men's basketball. This is KMAC Red Raider Nation's Countdown to Tip-Off. Hey there, welcome back to Countdown to Tip-Off. Okay, I don't know any of the big words that Collier said when he previewed this like yeah. three segments Food. ago. So I'm just going to say, let's crash the board. I'm hungry. He was yeah. talking about biscuits. I love rebounding. Okay, <laughs> so we talked about there's a lot of good scores in this game. Mm -hmm. So with that being said, over under two and a half 20 point scorers Ugh. total. Man, I can't imagine the Red Raiders are going to give up a lot of points again. I know the, the, I'm gonna the go Bayou over. Bengals. Uh, this is not even uh, going to be a knock on Texas Tech's defense. I just, from watching a couple LSU games, uh, this team just moves the ball so quickly. I just think it's more the idea that there's just going to be a lot of shots that go up. Yeah, and that might be the case. I think the Red Raiders want to slow it down a little bit, though, even though at times it seems like their offense is stagnant, but they got their 20-point score. LSU has their 20-point score, so I think two, but yeah. not not three. The issue with that is that kind of three-quarters court press that LSU mm -hmm. yeah. does, and it's designed to it's speed, it you, speed up. you up. It steals exactly. the ball, but it also gives well, a lot of Well, I'm going to contradict easy myself probably coming up here momentarily. Okay, so speaking of that, we talked mm -hmm. about steals. LSU, pretty good at that. They steal the ball just under 10 times a game. They make just over three, eight three-pointers a game. What will they do more? Well, yeah. since I said that there weren't going to be three 20-point scores. I'm going to say three-pointers. Uh, that Texas Tech defense cannot guard the three-point line. Yeah. And so LSU's going to get a lot of really good looks. I think they're going to hit a lot of those looks. I will go the other route. I will say that eventually the Red Raiders got to get that perimeter defense, right? It's been it's been decent in non-Big 12 games. Yeah. And last time I checked, this is a non-Big 12 game. So I'll go with the steals for LSU, which isn't necessarily a good thing for the Red Raiders either. Yeah, the only thing would be Tech would need to break its current trend of not turning the ball yeah. over a lot. Okay, let's go with a headline. All right, a headline. I might take a minute here, sorry. Okay, minus straight to the point. Yeah. Okay, M-A-C. So you know how the SEC, they chant, they do the classic S-C-C, S-C-C uh -huh. chant when yeah. they win. So the counter to that is M-A-C. M-A-C, because Matt yeah, I got, is going to go for a ton of points. Yeah, I went super long here just to make up for what I thought was not a good headline. Yeah. That's, how you, that's how you do it. I'm going to go with Louisiana State by you Bengals. So they're going to beat Louisiana State, and then they're going to wave bye to the Bengals. Yeah. Bye, you. Bye. Oh. Louisiana okay. State. No? That's a long one. It's I know. It's, I, know. It's I was better. just going to go Louisiana State, but then I just It's kept better going. than I thought it was going to be, honestly. Thank you. I appreciate that. Happy belated birthday, by the way. It was his birthday yesterday. Thank you. I feel old. All right. Let's uh, look at the rest of the matchups here in the Big 12. Sorry, I doesn't want to talk about age. Oh, nope. I was about to say, I have <laughs> nothing to say about that. All right. At 11 o'clock, ninth-ranked Alabama visits number 24, Oklahoma, Kansas State hosts Texas A&M. Two o'clock, or two other one o'clock games, rather, along with this Texas Tech-LSU matchup. TCU visiting number 11 for now, Missouri. And uh, West Virginia welcomes the Florida Gators to Morgantown. Two games tipping off at 3 o'clock. Dean Baylor faces Auburn. The Tigers already knocking off one ranked team earlier this week. I can't really remember who that was, though. Who was that? Probably Alabama. I think it was Missouri. Um, yeah, it was definitely Missouri. And Arkansas takes on Oklahoma State. Final two games are at 5. 15th ranked Kansas has its hands full with 18th ranked Tennessee. And Iowa State takes a trip to Mississippi State. Kentucky forced to cancel its meeting with Texas because of COVID-19 protocols. We gotta say that at least one show. All right, time for our final break here on Countdown to Tip Off. When we return, we look at the results from last week's pick three. And then I try to avoid the tie once again. I'm just rolling right along. I'm not winning, but I'm not tying.